evacuated from their homes. Welcome in. I'm Jim Dunaway. I'm Sherry Jackson. Tonight we have team coverage of those fires and the dry conditions that are fueling them. We begin with CBS 42 News reporter Matt Fernandez, who's live in McCullough. Matt? Yeah, just moments ago, I spoke with the fire chief, Magadori fire chief. He tells me that more than a dozen homes in this area near Shades Creek were evacuated. He just gave the green light that they can go back into their homes just minutes ago. Now, this fire started earlier this afternoon. They've been out here for about four hours or so. He said that 31 acres have burned. Right now, he said the fire is contained and they're working on fire breaks. This fire is also near Tannehill State Park. Officials notified uh, officials at that park where about 700 campers were. And the damage to the homes, around, uh, there was no damage to any homes around here, but a camper as well as a tractor were burned in the fire. Now, I spoke with uh, the homeowner where this fire was happening. He says he's lived here about 20 years and uh, he wasn't home at the time when the fire started. I left this morning to go out and eat breakfast and uh, came back. And, uh, that thing was on fire, forest fire for some reason. And once again, the fire chief says that people in this area are allowed to go back to their home. The fire is contained and they're working on fire breaks right now. Reporting live, Matt Fernandez, CBS 42 News.